Update my postpartum wife wants to leave our baby with me to go a several month vacation by herself and she won't take no for an answer. My wife kept asking me about the trip and at one point even threatened me to go on it without telling me if I don't just give in. Seeing how stubborn she was, I took a full night of sitting and thinking about it, and the next day I sat my wife down and told her that I, again, do not feel comfortable with her being in a different continent for such a long period of time away from our newborn. I feel this would not be good for our daughter and our marriage. I do not make decisions for her, but I would also take steps to ensure that there are going to be consequences if she doesn't take my opinions into consideration. After all, this decision to spend so much money and be away from the household, me stepping up entirely and exhausting my PTO needs two yeses. If she chooses to go, she may come home to a daughter, but not a welcoming husband. That it will permanently change our relationship and I might not be interested in continuing a relationship with someone who can so easily abandon her family. And for that wound, she would be the only one responsible. The thing is, I have tried my best to be empathetic to her situation and offered compromises, but she just wouldn't listen, and so I had to be straightforward and explain my stance as seriously as I could. At this point, she was growing very anxious to the point she started crying. I calmed her down and told her that we need to fix whatever issues we have, and it is glaringly obvious she needs a break too. For that, first, she would have to agree to travel domestically and only after our kid is a year old, and compromise on traveling for no more than seven days, with the condition that I get to have a similar break too at a later time. Also, she needs to get into therapy for a more comprehensive evaluation for PPD, because I do not feel comfortable with her mental state right now. Whatever it may be. She wasn't just fantasizing about the Europe trip, but had actually begun drawing up plans that time. I let her know that this has dented my trust in her as a parent and a partner and she would need to introspect and make improvements accordingly. If I still feel weird about this, we may need couples counseling too, to re-establish the trust. After all, asking me to sacrifice my PTO, step up for a month, and have funds that family has the first right over, was a big ask.